Oh hi, thanks for watching my video. I've been feeling a little bit nostalgic recently and I was thinking about one of my favourite things to do in The Sims 2. When I was at school and I used to play The Sims 2 all the time and one of them was the baking competition. It's been a long time since I did one of those. I used to love getting my sims to make a pie and then stand anxiously waiting to find out whether they won or not. And then I remembered there's a pie making competition in The Sims 4 as well. So I thought, for a bit of fun, we'll play through the Finchwick Garden Fair with my sim here, her name's Avery. We're gonna make a pie, we're gonna enter it into the competition and see if we win. And then we're gonna do the same thing in The Sims 2 just to experience both side by side, and I guess see how it's evolved. I'm not gonna lie, there isn't really a lesson to be learned here, I just really wanted to uh, relive my childhood and enter a pie making competition. So today is Saturday morning, it's the day of the Finchwick Garden Fair. So far, uh, we don't actually have anything prepared, but that's because Avery, she's a really good cook, but we're going to first off head down to the market because I want to see if I can pick up some kind of rare ingredient that I can put into my pie, like dragon fruit or something like that. By the time I loaded up this family, she lives with the Macmillan family by the way, it was already only a day away from this fair, so I just thought, well, there's not really much point trying to grow something now. So instead we're going to see if we can take a shortcut and find something worth entering at the fruit and veg stall. What time does it open? Nine? All right, that's fine, I'll hang around for an hour. There's a pub there, I can grab a pint. Early morning pint. So the fair doesn't start till 3.30, so that should give me plenty of time to get my ingredients, turn it into jam, and then bake a pie out of it. Let's just hope she's got something rare. What have you got for me, Kim? Tell me you got some dragon fruit, girl. Apple pie, that's really common. Everyone's gonna have an apple pie, aren't they? Uh, we'll get blackberry just in case they don't have anything that interesting. Oh, dragon fruit! Okay, okay. Right, let's just grab a couple bits. Right, that'll do for me. Let's go home. If I can make dragon fruit pie, I might just win this competition. And that's what this channel's really about. Winning things. Trying your best and then getting immediate payoff because if you don't, you should be embarrassed. Okay, okay. I don't see any option to make a dragon fruit pie. Oh, that is some bullshit. Why? Why not? Okay, make a chocolate pie then. Let's see how we get on with the chocolate pie. Maybe, maybe dragon fruit pie is under a different menu? Maybe I can't make a dragon fruit pie. Maybe I just made that up. Well, hopefully if it comes out excellent quality, we might just win anyway. Right now, Avery, when this is made, don't start eating it, okay? Very important. Put it on the table. Let me check, is it excellent quality? Yes. Okay, we might just win the Finchwick Fair. Okay, well, you um, go about your business, enjoy yourself, do what you want, and I'll let you know when it's time to enter our pie into the competition. I'll let you know when it's pie time. Oh, moment of truth. Let's go to the fair. We'll go by ourselves. I think we might win. We still have an excellent quality pie. The thing I miss most from The Sims 2 is when Sims would stand at the table and they'd stand there like nervous, nervously biting their nails and just looking really uncomfortable while waiting to be judged. But I don't think they do that here. Okay, submit entry. Chocolate pie. She's an excited competitor. Avery is feeling good about her chances of winning. Oh good, good for you Avery. I'm glad. I wonder if I could submit something for the gardening. I wonder if I could submit like a store-bought dragon fruit. Can I submit that even though I didn't harvest it? That is so cheeky. Imagine if we won the gardening section. Why did this chick come over to me just to yell at me? Maybe she saw me down here earlier buying that dragon fruit from the garden shop or from the fruit and veg stand even. I bet this pie is going to grab a slice of victory. Look how fancy it is. Oh, I think so too, you know. Guys, I'm not being funny, but this village fate is completely dead. No one else has entered anything. What time is this meant to end? 9.30 p.m. Oh, okay, there's still plenty of time then. Okay, fine, fine. Well, then I guess we'll just hang around. See who else submits a... Uh... Oh, someone's... What is that? Christmas rose. <laughs> Joke. Any more pies submitted? Oh, someone's brave. What is that? Pumpkin, is it? Yeah. Made by Jen Farmer. Oh, she's got a thumbs down. Did the kids submit one? 
Oh, yeah. Cow plant essence meringue pie. Well, you should hold your head in shame, kid, because you're not going to fucking win. Sorry to break that to you. Right, time's getting on. It's, it's gone eight o'clock. Who wins the competition, Maya? Huh? Oh, there's another entry over here. What is it? Poison fire leaf. What a joke. Yep, yeah, no question in my mind as to who's going to win this. The festival will end in one hour. Finish up any activities. Oh, I wanted to find out. I want to find out if I've won. The verdict just doesn't come soon enough. It's like what you want to happen doesn't happen soon enough. I feel like that's a trend with The Sims 4. Oh, wait. All the stalls are going, so who won? Finchwick Fair Reward, one potato, wo one rose, one second place garden competition. Okay, fine. Congratulations, your plant won second place at the Finchwick Fair. Please check your Sims household inventory to find your plant. Okay, but what about my pie? I also submitted a pie. No update on the pie whatsoever, so I have no idea if I won the pie. Well, I guess not. I guess not. Well, let's go home and check our household inventory. Maybe it just doesn't work if you enter both competitions. I'd like to say I'm surprised <laughs> that it didn't work properly, but I'm not really. I wonder if she has a milestone for entering the competition. I don't, don't think so. No. Pretty sure you do get a memory in The Sims 2, but I think you only get a memory if you win a baking competition. Yeah, I got my pie back, but no idea if it won. And I only have to wait four more sim weeks before I can enter that fair again. Brilliant. I don't mean to be overly negative about The Sims 4. There are a lot of things about The Sims 4 that I quite enjoy. It's just whenever I try to um, recreate some of the fun things from The Sims 2, it just never quite measures up in The Sims 4. It's either not the same in terms of quality or it just doesn't work at all. So with that in mind, let's try this out in The Sims 2. Okay, I have my sim, Janessa Jericho. You might recognise her, she's the one who exploited her dog Pluto, who's now a superstar. Yeah, she's got really into cooking since we last saw her. So, we will call a taxi. So The Sims 2 is a bit different. You don't have to prepare a meal and bring it with you. Instead, you go to a lot that has a cooking competition on it, and everything is done there, on the competition lot. Notice the couch is gone. I think Pluto might have eaten it. Oh, here we go. Desi we're in Desiderata Valley. And we're going to go to the kitchen cook-off. Come on, Janessa girl, get in that car. Don't even worry about getting dressed. Oh, she, she actually isn't. She's just going to go in her pyjamas. I wonder if she's still going to be wearing those when she gets out the car. All right, here we are. This is the lot. They've got their little trophies here. They've got two different kitchens and some food judges. So we're going to take the blue kitchen, make food for contest. Oh, okay, so this is something that I have misremembered. I forgot that you can make literally anything you want. I think the only reason why I thought it was a pie contest is because I always chose pie. <laughs> oh, but no, you can enter any food. You could enter lobster thermidor. I can't believe you didn't get dressed, Janessa. I wonder if I can change her outfit with cheats. Change suit casual one. She's put the food in her inventory. Okay, good, good. Plan outfit. Could I do that, maybe? I just wanted her to be wearing her little baking dress, but I guess it's not going to happen. Oh, okay, perfect. I was able to do it with the clothing thing. <laughs> okay, cool, cool. I knew there was some kind of cheat to be able to get changed into my normal clothes. Okay, submit food. There's my serving platter with my berry pie, ready to be judged. You ready, Janessa? Select a dish, berry pie. Oh, see, she's all nervous, anxiously waiting for someone to take a taste and tell me we won. Who's this bitch? What's she doing? Is that just mac and cheese? <laughs> what a joke. Okay, what's this guy submitting? Cereal? Really? You guys think you stand a chance with those two dishes? <laughs> These guys, man. Well, so far, I'm pretty sure I'm going to smoke the competition, but let's see who contestant number four is. Do we have a fourth contestant? Oh, I think that, okay, there we go, that's contestant number four. Okay, I might be fucked, actually, with that jelly thing. Uh, she might actually win, but let's see, the judge is taking a bite. What does he think of my pie? Huh? She's nervous. What do you think, huh? Tell me. Oh, no response. She's like, oh, no, that's not good. He didn't cheer or anything. On the bright side, it looks like the mac and cheese was a bit shit as well. See, look how nervous they're all standing there while the judge is going one by one and trying their food. What do you think of the jelly? Please don't cheer, because that means I've lost. 
Okay, he's writing it down. I'll try and sneak over his shoulder and see what he's written. Well, what's the verdict? <gasps> yes! Janessa has won the food contest along with 500 simoleons. We also placed a special prize in Janessa's inventory. Oh! -ho -ho -ho. Look at that! We got a little cooking badge! Well done, Janessa. You won a ribbon. I can't believe we won. I didn't think we would. Okay, well, let's go home and see what we've got in our inventory. What was our our gift? We'll go home. Well, we entered two cooking competitions. We won one of them, which is this one. The first one, we, we don't know. But let's just say we won that one as well, because I'm pretty sure we would have. We definitely had the best pie. Oh, she's back in her pajamas now. <laughs> so cheating her outfit only worked for that lot. All right, what's our special gift? <gasps> we got a plaque. Look at that framed ribbon. So proud. So proud. And on that note, I'm going to end this video here. Just a little bit of fun. No real set goal. And I've achieved about everything I wanted to do today. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please like and subscribe. You know I love it when you do that. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.